Welcome back to Sunrise. With me is Mr. Doug Stanton with IMI Global. Doug, good to have you here. Yeah, good to be here too, Landry. A whole IMI uh, verification team along with where food comes from. appreciate the opportunity to be back again here in beautiful Steamboat and visit with you this morning. Well, we're so glad to have you. Let's talk about, we've been in partnership, um, you've been in partnership with Superior for a long time. Talk about that partnership. Yes, we have for a long time. It's been a great relationship. Um, the Superior Verified is kind of a unique program that we've built for uh, the superior customers. Um, it is a source and age verification, continues to have value in the marketplace. And then late in the recent years, we've created the pink tag, uh, we kind of stand out a little bit. And then we've had the slogan, turn pink into green and return dollars for our customers through verification programs. Very good. Um, let's talk about bundling. Tell me a little bit how that works. Okay. The source and age verification still has value in the marketplace, even though the requirements have changed with Japan. But um, uh, there are uh, it's both at, uh, it serves as a baseline for us for other programs, for the NHTC program, for the Never Ever 3, and also for GAP. So it it's continues to have value as far as a baseline for other programs. Um, we've also had some packers tell us that uh, they prefer that, uh, and recommend that uh, the feeders continue to get the cattle source and age verified because they, even though the requirements for maybe domestic and export programs are for 30 months and younger, it still has value in the marketplace there. So the pink tag continues to have value. Um, and then, um, so it, as, once again, it just it gives us a, a place to start and then build programs from there. And let's talk a little bit more about that pink tag. How do you get, um, how does somebody get that pink tag? Through the, our source and age verification program, they'll get the pink tag. And then, then we, lately, uh, we've, with the ADT and USDA's um, uh, Animal Disease and Traceability Program, we are now offering the 840 pink tag. Um, so they can meet the ADT requirements um, uh, down the road if it's required because today it's for cattle 18 months of age or older and all dairy cattle that move interstate. So uh, as long as they have a premise ID, that's an option that we now offer to them and they can order an 840 tag when they do their source and age verification and then they'll be prepared for things down the road. Very good. And if, if somebody wanted more information, where will they go or who can they contact? They can contact us. We have a booth here uh, all this week. We also go to our website. We have a Facebook page that, the, that our girls in the office keep up to date. And, uh, and then there are also information to the, in the catalog um, about our ad uh, and it talks about our different programs, along with there's some information about ADT in there, too. Alrighty, well, Doug, I wanted to thank you for joining me this morning. And folks, when we come back, a, a very special guest that we haven't seen in quite some time. Stay with us.